Hey guys, welcome back to Sports Talk with John, and we're going to be talking today about Melvin Gordon signing a one-year deal with the Baltimore Ravens. Now, this is coming after, you know, the deadline tag where Saquon Barkley, Josh Jacobs, Tony Pollard, and a lot of other running backs didn't get paid and stated that they are unhappy with the position. Um, so, it's good to see a running back get signed, at least, uh, for whatever it's worth. But that's a totally another topic, and this is about Melvin Gordon. Now, I think for Baltimore with J.K. Dobbins kind of dealing with health issues, though, I think he'll make his way back on the field. It's never terrible to have insurance. And Melvin Gordon has proven that he's probably not a bell cow back and probably never will be, but he's a good back. He's a good death piece, and you always need one other good back because the main issue with the running back mark is that they can't stay healthy. So it's never bad to have insurance, and it's no disrespect to anything else. Now, Melvin Gordon had struggled since he's went to Denver with uh, 90 carries last year, 318 yards, two touchdowns, and about four yards a carry, roughly, um, which is about backup numbers. Maybe a backup didn't really play, and he didn't really play much. I have to admit I had him on fantasy, and he didn't do much either there. But I think for Baltimore, it's good. They need a depth, and I think Melvin Gordon's going to get a shot to get real playing time and a more favorable position for him. Um, I know uh, Baltimore lost Ben Power, so we'll see how that line is still going forward. But I think it'll be good. I think he'll be fine. I think it's a good signing. Good for Baltimore and good for Melvin Gordon. And uh, for what it's worth, good for the running backs. All right, guys, with that being said, like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more breaking news, more videos, and all the content you can ask for. Thank you, guys.